Hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got Happy Birthday, Jen, at Hafina Creations. This is an Instagram collaboration hosted by Tinkerbell 1970s. Our theme was Jen's latest hair color. I've got a picture coming up so you can see. It's so pretty. Here we go. Isn't that gorgeous? Love it. We're going to start off with some Maniology Sticky Base Coat on some nail tips. And we're going to get these decorated. And then I'm going to put them on my nails at the end of the video. So you can see. These are gorgeous. I'll be using Drip Drop Nail Paint. And this is Tidy Whitey's. We're just going to go over these nails real quick with a coat of that. Because to do Jen's hair color, I'm going to be doing a gradient. And I want it to pop. I'll be using Super Chick Lacquer Swoon. Oh my gosh, how pretty. And Super Chick Lacquer Pheromone. So here we go. I've got a dampened makeup sponge that I've cut down. And we're going to get started on this here. Oh, it's you guys. See, I already know what it looks like. So I am so stoked to share it with you. And I started with the pink a little high up. So we're going to have to fix that here in a minute. Because I'm realizing, oh, these nail tips are too long. Oh, Lord, girl. So, we're going to go in and do the end of this sponge with the pink. And then I'm going to squeeze some more yellow back in up at the top. That'll be okay because it's right there where the colors are going to meld and combine. And, you know. And after we get into this dabbing, we'll, we'll you know, have to reload and I'll put more yellow in. So look how gorgeous that is. The coverage is amazing on these polishes. They are so pigmented. These are some of my all-time favorite polishes in my collection. And um, I, I don't use them as often as I would like to. But, you know, as hoarders, man, we're trying to hang on to the good stuff. I don't know what we're hanging on to it for, but that's what we do. So we're getting this loaded back up real quick. You saw I got three nails out of that one, so I'm going to go over these last two. And then we're going to add um, a little more to the other ones, I believe. But doing them on this little nail stand makes it so easy. Because I can let things dry out and in between my steps of the manicure. So we're going to reload that sponge again. Now I have sped this video up. Um, it's at 1.25 speed. And... Uh, that way you get to see all of it, but you don't have to be here forever <laughs> to see it. I'm going back over some of these real quick. It just, oh, these are so, so pretty. I love, love how these turned out. I love them just like this. Just like that. I'm going to top it with the Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. Look how pretty. Love, love this. Ugh. And I'll be using BPL-003. I'm going to break out another stamping plate here in a little bit. And I got my Cube Stamper and my Maniology Scraper and Bases Loaded Lacquer on the black. So I'm doing this image here on my ring fingernail and my thumb nail. And then I'm going to do something different with the other three nails. This is so fun. By the way, I will have a link down below for the hashtag over on Instagram if you'd like to go check out the other manicures. And there should also be a participation list uh, listed down below that you can click on. Ooh, isn't that pretty? Um, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Got to get my little tape, get the little flyaways. There we go. We'll clean that off with some acetone. And we're going to do it again. Give it another, another one. This one's going on the thumbnail. And I'll go ahead and just give you a heads up. Um, I don't nail it. <laughs> um, I end up having to do some patchwork stamping because this image might could have fit the nail. But um, I didn't quite get it right. So I'm going to have to go in and get some more for that tip. Clean my stamper off on a lint roller. Clean the plate off a little bit. I don't need the whole image. I just need a little bit for that tip that I missed. And it'll all be good. It's on the thumb anyway. So, you know, you don't really... The thumb doesn't get a lot of love. 
when you're showing off a manicure. Using a little piece of tape to get up some excess that I don't want. And then try to line this up. I don't think I'm going to do a very good job, but like I said, it's okay. All right, out of frame. Get it in frame, Tina. Come on, frame it up, girl. Okay, well, we got we got something done on that one. Oh, oh, oh. Get the tape out again. Get the fl fuzzy flyaways. Okay, well, it's on there. And from a distance, it really doesn't look bad, so it's okay. It'll be good. Maniology MXM035. I decided this wispy look, this is like a ponytail, not a ponytail, a pony mane or a unicorn mane image. I thought that that would work really good and still leave a lot of the gradient visible for the other nails. Just tie it all in together. And I'm going to do that on the other two nails. So we've got three nails done with this image. Aren't we having some kind of difficulties? Get it together. Get back on track. Yep, this bottle of on the black is getting low. We are going to eke everything out of it we can. And then we're going to pray that there's a backup in my collection. Because it's a favorite. Plop it on. Very nice. And I'm really excited about this one. I can't wait to see everybody's manicures. I just, oh, that's part of the fun for doing collabs for me is seeing everybody's take on the theme. It just always makes me happy to see everybody's stuff. It's like getting together and playing, and I like it. So, roop. And here we go. Plop that on there on that little skinny pinky nail. All right. Clean up time. We're going to clean up this stamping plate with some acetone. And wipe it with a lint-free wipe. And then check the back. And then clean up that little stampy mat. Flip this cotton ball over so I can get a good clean. Sometimes I think I've got them clean and they're not. I am going to top these with Maniology Smudge Free Top Coat. Look how pretty. That is just stunning. Oh my God, I love it. Crisp images. And then these little lines on the other one. Just To me, it just worked. Totally worked. Loved it. So, Jen, I hope you have a wonderful birthday. Okay, so now we're going to finish these off with some Sesh Vite top coat. This is my glossy fast drying top coat here. Kept that pre edge. Oh, I love it. Love where in the middle it meets. It does the little orange thing. I love that. Alright. So there we go. Get Woody out here. Hi Woody, how you doing? See, y'all didn't think you were going to see him today. <laughs> All right, so I've got one of those little glue tabs on my fingernail, and I'm just going to mush this down. And if you're planning on wearing these, definitely mush, mush, mush. Do a good job. Here's my swatch photo. I do hope you enjoyed this one. So pretty. I want to thank you for watching. Until next time, be good to yourself.